Hi guys! Welcome to another video from us at the boutique. <laughs> How is everyone today? I know we I spoke to some of you earlier when we did the little hoodoo competition. So exciting. So I am today reviewing Pink Parcel. Absolutely love this box. So I'm so excited. Because I just want to share my thoughts on this month's box. Um, I mean, like I've been following Pink Parcel for a while. Uh, for a good couple of months. I mean, I used to get another subscription box that was a bit like this one. But um, it got a little bit the same, if you know what I mean. So... Um, I, did, I decided to go for this one and to be fair I've, I've not had a bo bad box yet so everything's been quite good and consistent in a way <laughs> but yeah this is all my own thoughts on Pink Parcel so let's get started then shall we so it comes in a big box which I'm happy about because I don't know. I feel like I'm getting more from money. It's, it gives you that sense of, you know, misdirection. <laughs> I, I had to laugh as well because I had it upside down when I opened it. And it says clearly on the back, but me, being JC, says, please turn me over before opening. I opened it upside down. Now... I had friends over as well, so it was a little bit, in, well, I'd say it's a bit embarrassing, but it weren't really. Like everything fell out of it. <laughs> but it's what happens, isn't it? You know. So, yeah. So, it has its signature pink and grey box. But you always know that this is a pink parcel box. Right. So inside, oh, I'll hide all the goodies because we have some leaflets in here as well but I'll hide those because otherwise I'm just going to give the game away straight away aren't I? So there you go, that's inside the box. Nice and pink. I personally hate pink, <laughs> it's not one of my favourite colours but I think this goes really nicely for you know what it says really so this month's is the pink parcel post positivity parcel we all need a bit of positivity especially after christmas because if you like me i quit my christmas went too bad but i don't know I, I feel like i need something to perk me up a bit because i ate a, a lot of food i didn't move around anyway so I feel like I put five stone on. My eyesight seems to have got worse from all the drinking I've probably done. <laughs> you know what I mean? So we need a little bit of positivity in our lives. And January needs it the most. Because we all get Christmas blues. The New Year's blues and stuff like that. So oh, I'm not sure you what's in the leaflet. Because obviously that has everything inside it. And it also has leaflets <laughs> oh thanks for each so in your usual pink parcel um you tell them what you need you know in tampons wise towel wise you know if you you need a bit more of a heavier flow and stuff like that you know and i love the fact um in pink parcel they actually give you the right amount of sanitary stuff to use Whereas I've had another box before in the past on the same lines and no word of a lie, I had to literally run to the shop about two days after because there wasn't that many. Another thing that I love about this box is, the, well, one thing is the little compartments that it has. It's there a lot. And you also get this cute little bag because... Oh, this is so handy i mean like little drawstring thing hang it up in your bathroom or wherever 
wherever you want to hang them up, you know, from the ceiling. <laughs> then you've you've got it, you know, with little bits in. You know, because I've got little towels in or whatever, little tam packs. And just put it beside your toilet or something. You know what I mean? Just hanging up. Let's take cute with its little bows on as well. So, you know. I'll, I'll have mine out in the uh, bathroom. I'm not bothered. <laughs> so, yeah. So, we've got um, the for later box, which is obviously got all your tampons and everything in. So, like I said, you get literally loads. You know what I mean? Absolutely loads. So, you've got them in the bag, and then you've got a full box of those. You, you're not going to run out anytime soon, are you? Well, I don't know about me, but <laughs> TMI, JC, TMI. Right. So, and also you get um, the finite box as well. Got a little. The, um, let's have a look. You get the um, the night towels in that one, which is really handy because they come in useful. I'm not going to why, but they do. <laughs> You want me to count them and tell you how many there are? I'm going to do it just to say that I have. What, tampacks or towels? <laughs> so you get five in that one. I'm going to do this dead quick. You get five in the bag with five diddy towels. Little diddies. <laughs> so five in those, five of the towels. And how many in the box? Someone uh, guess how many there will be. Let's have a little game while we're watching. Can anyone guess? <laughs> Your night towels look different to the ones they have sent me. Can't use them as they look like giant adult nappies. <laughs> I know, that's the only thing about towels. They've got to be extra thick. You feel like you're wearing another pair of uh, knickers or something, don't you? you? You know. Now, there were 16. So that's a really good number. There's 16 in them, 5 in them, 21. My age. <laughs> so yeah, you've got your night ones in there. So then you're all set for a month. And if you've got some left over, then that's good, isn't it? Because then you'll never run out. You know, and um, any ones that I have as well in my pink parcel, I always um, donate to women's shelter. You know, if I have any left over. So, but anyway, this is one of the most exciting parts of pink parcel, is the for you box. A little something to cheer you up. Hopefully, this cheers me up today because I've not had a very good day today. You know, but. Hi to everyone that's joined. It's lovely to see you all. I love it when members get involved. You know, we'd like to hear from you as much as possible. So if you see all my posts that I put when I'm asking loads about you, it's because I do want to know loads about you. I want to know everything about our members. You know, because that's what you make us, us as a group. So. <laughs> but yeah. Right. Ooh. First thing that I pulled out... And to be fair, I do use this. Um, I don't know if I've run out. I prob probably have done. I've put it in my handbag somewhere. But um, I'm not a very good eyebrow person. So when I actually do it nice, you know, well, do my eyebrows nice, they have to be hairsprayed on or something. Because if I smudge them, it's World War Three, you know. So I've got some brow coat. I love my lip coat. Best thing to use when you've got a smudgy lipstick. And brow coat, don't let your eyebrows move. <laughs> it's like Botox for your brows. <laughs> They're like that, just stiff. <laughs> so yeah, that's really good to use. Um, I personally won't pour it in the box because it's just something that I pick up every... What's it? But it is, it's handy, isn't it? You know... It's, but like I said, I probably ran out and I won't think to pick it up for ages until I'm like, oh yeah, I've ran out of brow coat. You, you know what I mean? So, it's just 
good to have in really isn't it yeah but yeah uh, next thing and I ha I've had these ones before uh, the we are tea peppermint leaf infusion tea I do love my herbal teas and to be fair I have run out of, of most of them because I feel like I need a health kick you, you know, we're, we're Christmas being over and done with, I need something to, like, detoxify everything that is going wrong in my body. <laughs> it's all the chocolate and wine, you know. I'm, I swear I'm not an alcoholic or anything, but I replace wine with herbal tea. <laughs> Best thing in it, really. But, yeah, it is really nice. I've tried these ones before. The ideal, you know, little tea bags. I feel like a pick-me-up. Pop it in your bag or whatever, you know, take to work. Yeah, really good. Right, next thing is, ooh, see I haven't had these before and I've been dying to get some. I've seen people post about them and I've really wanted some because I'm constantly tying my hair back. Please excuse how messy my hair is today, to be fair, but <laughs> it's um, the bandies. And look, they come in such a cute little bag as well. I mean, am I, am I like, I'm not on my own ear, but does anyone lose their bobbles constantly? I mean, like, I've got one on my wrist now because I, I can never find the things. <laughs> They're just everywhere. I think I must uh, go through around about 100 bobbles a month because I just lose them. I lose them everywhere. So oh they're so cute look look at him just little giddy things you know absolutely love them and i love the colors as well you know and they're just so cute aren't they just to put on your wrist because that's where i'm gonna live <laughs> and it look, looks better than the average black bobble but yeah um oh so cute isn't it and they don't hurt, they don't cut off circulation to your wrist. You know, because sometimes I feel like I'm going to get a blue hand. Or it's just swollen up because I'm cutting off all the blood to it. So, these, they're stretchy and they're nice. So, I'm really happy that I've got these. Because, like I said, I've been after some for ages, to be fair. You know. So, cute little bag, I'm going to keep everything in there. Well, hair grips, that's another thing that you can't find. <laughs> Go for about a thousand of them a month. <laughs> right, uh, next thing we've got is, and I've got a couple of bottles of this already actually, is the Made by Cooper's Apothecary uh, Happy Lime Basil and Clementine Atmosphere Mist. Hmm. Now, I'm, I'm not a massive fan of atmosphere mist to be fair because we use a lot of wax melts and stuff like that for you know um just to make your room smell nice and that makes me happy you know smelling pina colada burning or candy cane forest that makes me happy and to be fair like i'm not a massive fan of lime and basil it's not really my flavour, so I'm glad that I'm actually getting rid of a couple of bottles of these. But yeah, I mean, like, it, it, if it works, then you know it's really good because it's it's meant to just make you happier, isn't it? I suppose with, with it being January, you do need a little bit of um, pick me up or whatever. So just spray this in your face, or <laughs> well, not directly in your face. I mean, in in the air. Sorry, I should say. Don't spray anything in your face. Spray it in the air. <laughs> we'll scratch that bit out, shall we? Right, next thing that we've got, and you can never have too many of these, is the... Oh, God. You know what? I, I, somet sometimes I get a box and I get a brand that I can never say the name. So somebody help me out here, even though I can't hear you say it, but it's um, Laritzi, is it? Laritzi Cosmetics Eye Pencil. Um, I always use eye pencils because I love a bit of, you know, eyeliner or whatever. Outlines your eyes. Oh, this one's in night blue. 
I haven't got a blue pencil. You can't, you can't really tell. <laughs> no, I've not been drinking, Kez. <laughs> I'm just really happy to, well, I'm happy now. You know, I'm a bit hyper. <laughs> well, yeah, it's um like a dark blue. Have a look, we'll swatch it a bit. Ooh, I might actually use that. Can't really see it. I mean, I've put about, I've got two lamps on, a main light, because the, um, the uh, lighting in this room is not actually that great. So, but yeah, that's the um, dark blue liner. So yeah, I'm going to try that. I'm going to use that with um, my Sukulta palette, actually, because I feel like I, I use a lot of blues in there. Um, so that will, you know, it'll just go, won't it? So yeah, that'd be nice to use. And it's really sharp as well, to be fair. It's not dug a hole in my hand, but I mean like, you know, it's it's not going to blunt anytime soon. Until I sharpen it. <laughs> right. Oh, this looks interesting. Plant based vegan. Vega, Vega, I would say. Essentials nutritional powder in chocolate flavour. I haven't tried this one before. I do actually use some nutritional powders, but I haven't really had a plant-based one before. I've had um, like a, a top up in protein and stuff with protein powders, um, but I've never really tried one like this. So it's a plant blend of protein, fruit and vegetable powders in chocolate flavour. So I'll try this in my little shaker and I'll let you know what it's like. Oh is it? Well, I, we'll let us see, won't we? <laughs> they do have like a little, you know where they give you a little recipe? They've got that on the back. So I might try it that way, what do you reckon? So, um, it's a chocolate banana smoothie. So you do it with cold non-dairy drink, um, one banana and half a cup of ice. Optional, two teaspoons of cocoa powder. I might try both. I might do half and half and see how I feel about that. But the best thing to do is hold your nose and down it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just hold your nose and down it. Because then you've got all your goodness. And even if you you're not sure, you don't like it, you've still drank it. <laughs> so, right. Uh, next one is um, Monte Montezuma's chili and lime milk chocolate. I've never really tried chili chocolate before. I do love a bit of spice. Nah, shall I try it? Who wants me to try it on camera? <laughs> oh yeah. Now I can smell the lime more than anything. Please tell me that this is nice because do you know if anyone's actually tried it and said it's nice, please tell me because I love my chocolate. And if it goes drastically wrong, I feel like I'm going to be put off chocolate for the rest of the month. <laughs> you know what I mean? Which might be a good thing, we it being January. You know, oh, sorry. You know what I mean? It might be a good thing. So. Right. I love my chocolate. Please tell me it's nice. <laughs> things but it's when it gets you right at back at throat 
and you just like oh. I could taste the lime in it and my mouth water. <laughs> I don't know if I start dripping everywhere, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Has it put me off chocolate? No. I'll eat it. It's fine. Just have a glass of uh, milk to go with it. <laughs> oh, God. I think you all wanted me to choke, didn't you? You all wanted to see me struggle with that. So. <laughs> it's not that bad, honestly. Honestly, Rachel, it's not that bad. Everyone's making out that it's absolutely horrible. It just feels as if you've just been punched in the throat slightly. Maybe just prodded, you know. So yeah, that's pink parcel. We have your usual. And I did count them. They were 16. <laughs> and five tampons and five pads in that one. Where's my other one gone? Oh, it's there, look. And then your night ones. Oh, I'm not selling it. Honestly, it's really nice. Mmm. <laughs> no, it is. It is quite nice. I, I'm i enjoying it, but it, I will, you know, I'll get that kick. So, yeah. Got a uh, plant-based vegan nutritional powder. I'll see how that is. Uh, write up the review and let you know. Um, The bandies. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, don't let melt in your mouth. Chew it. <laughs> no, I'll tell you what, it is really creamy though. Really creamy. It's lovely. So yeah, bandies in its cute little bag. Love them. Got the Made by Coopers Happy Atmosphere Mist which I'm not a big fan of the smell and I probably won't use this so I'll pass that forward um, we've got a WeRT peppermint leaf I am going to have that before bed actually because I love my herbal teas I'm, I've run out of the sleepy one that I usually have so I'm happy that I've actually got another one just to that might take the taste of the um, chilli what do you reckon? <laughs> Stop eating it. No, it's chocolate. You've got to eat it. You know what I mean? <laughs> got the brow coat. And the La Ritzy, uh eye pencil, which I got in night blue. So, so my thoughts on this box, I'd say I'm not amazingly thrilled of this month i do think it's still like i love pink parcel the past ones that i've had have been absolutely brilliant i am still happy but i'm not 100 percent wowed by it if you know what i mean but then again i, I mean it's such good value for 12.99 you know what i mean because you get all your sanitary stuff, which I probably pick up at shop for about four pound, you know. And then you've got. I mean, I don't know how much these are. I'm going to price these up. But actually, it should say in here. Oh, so that. I mean, how many grams? That's thirty-six gram. For um, six hundred and thirteen gram, it's thirty pound. So. And this little beauty, <laughs> 99p. And then your brow coat is 6 99 which, yeah, that's about right because I've had it at that price before. Um, 2 99 for 15 bags of those. Um, let's have a look at the eyeliner. The eye pencil is £18. So, really... You know, twelve ninety nine for your box. That's worth eighteen pound. So everything else is just a freebie, isn't it? That's how you gotta look at it. And uh, your bandies is five ninety five, or four ninety five with a bandy subscription. I didn't know that they actually did a subscription. I might look into that. So then I can collect more and lose more <laughs> all over the house. 
I tell you, when I move house, I'll probably find everything just stashed everywhere. And the happy mist, where is it gone? There it is. There is, uh, how many mil is it for this? 30 mil, and it's 12 pound. So, that's a really good value box, but I think it's because, like, when I have a monthly box for a period, I don't know, I just feel like I just want to eat loads of chocolate and sweets, I just want to be pampered. Whereas, like, I think January's has been quite a bit of a health kick kind of box, which I understand with everyone, you know, well, I say everyone, I haven't. <laughs> you join the gym, you know, stuff like that even though I, re I really do want to so maybe I'll let you know if, it, if I drink that it might motivate me to get to the gym <laughs> we'll see so yeah I've been quite happy with this box so I don't know about you guys but yeah thank you for watching I hope you've had fun laughing at me coughing at chilli chocolate and I'll speak to you all soon <laughs> Love you all. Bye. Mwah.